Hi, it's me, Jen, again. So I had this idea. I have a messy desk, and it's not going to take me that long to straighten it up. But I thought I would bring you along. And, you know, I'm just going to put some things away. So I have all my beads in one section. And then, if you're ever interested in seeing a tour of my craft room then let me know and I'll give you a tour it's nothing fancy smanchy it took me a long time to get an idea because everybody does the build-ins and that and I really wanted to come from a junk journaling perspective where I use a lot more junk or reusable goods or you know people that have cleared out their offices or things like that so that's just me it was because I wanted to be you know a recycle business I thought it would be really and you know I know people are doing technology but there's still a ton of people that use paper and stickers and things like that and so I just do my best to recycle them so I'm using a little barber neck brush kind of thing a thing from you know being a hairdresser and these are my little Bibles. I'll put them up there. My distressed inks. I normally have them over here. Hopefully I'm not pushing all my stuff off the desk. So I'm starting to get really organized. With all my gear. And what I wanted to do was. I noticed that I have all these books. Right? And like this one goes to the journal with me. This is journal with me. This is my journal, right? So I got that one. I'm going to stick it over here. And let's actually expand this so you can see my desk a little bit more so you can see how messy it is. You can see my shoes probably down, down there with my socks. Okay, so I don't want you to see my socks. <laughs> okay, so there you go. So, and then this is like the general I pull from. Like if I just want a little bit of something really quick. Um, little collage papers. Those are kind of a little bit too big to be down here. But just little stuff if I want to find something quick. Some of these big ones I don't want down there. Okay, so let's keep those here. Right? And then these are all cut there I just put that like that and then this is a box like from Costco okay so that's my general and then I use this to pull anything with this here right then I feel like I have okay here we go this scrap again another scrap thing right so these scraps, which are a ton, which are more of this family here, okay? So, over with, right? So then I have that, right? And then, where is it? Scrap, okay, I have fabric, and then I think this is, yeah, again. Here we go, more scraps, okay? More scraps. And then I want to make sure I get it all because I'm going to sort it so that it makes more sense. Oh, that's right. I do. I have one more. So I thought I'd bring you along in case you're having the same dilemma with where you have multiple stashes because I'm starting to notice I have multiple stashes. And I have, um, here's another one, see? This one's huge. Like, okay, let me lower this. But these are like, again, cards that were given to me. But this is like everything that's been given to me. And authentically, I am 
recording some really good stuff. I need to go through it though. So I thought I would go through all of this. Okay. So let me just make sure I have it all. So boom, boom. I know you can't see these other ones. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. Okay, remember our main. This is our main here. And then that's that one. We officially have them all here. So I'm going to, going to sort so that I can, I'm thinking, I'm going to do it by show. So it's always journal with me. That's my first show. And then it's altered book is my next show, right? That's what I got on my list. And then journal I'm building. That's just whatever journal I'm building. And I need to pull from general, right? I think just making ephemera out of I need to go through this. So that's going to be fun to go through today. I'm going to go through my stash. So, okay, so that's what we got going on here. I got to figure some things out. I just, I cleaned up my desk fairly quick. I do have to do this sorting though. This is what's making my desk a mess where I just want to be able to pull something out and use it. So, Anyways, thanks for joining me. I hope you're having a fabulous day. And I'm going to actually show you what my end result ended up being once I'm done with this, okay? So again, just so you can get an idea, here's my desk. Okay, my desk is clean. I mean, yeah, there's a little glitter here, a little glitter there. I got my chuny rocks out. Um, I mean, it's not completely clean, clean, because I have, like, anyways, I found some things for Big Idea Book, so I'm going to slip those up there, and we're going to deal with those. Hopefully, we'll be doing a video on, you know, this next week. Um, so let me show you what I did. Okay. So remember, I have <clears throat> the journal with me, the ultra book altered book sorry and then we have the um whatever journal i'm working on right okay so all the scraps remember all of those okay i put them in ziploc bag and i'm taking them in the house and i'm going to start gluing and making some major master boards so this will be a living room project and I will set up a camera in the other room so we can just do some of that and chit chat together okay so that's out of here and look what that did is it opened up this drawer is totally and completely free free of mayhem okay so there's that and then remember that other basket I had and it had all the cards I'm getting ready to go through that today and I may or may not film that it has a lot of private stuff in it so this is what I did um first for these are the things that I really just like and let me turn on the I chose to just use this little folder that was given to me from a friend InterVarsity is the name, and um, I just put a tag on the front of it. I left the tape where she had it and all that good stuff. I need to make cat tags out of that later, but I just use it as a little background. And then I put all my papers in here that I want to continue to use for my journal, my altar. Like, I can grab from here. These are some of my favorite little papers. They may not look much to you, but I just love these paper so I put them there okay and then what I did is I did look at this I cut everything down into two things boom okay so there was that right we're gonna close that and now everything is in here so this is what I did all the pink stuff I put here because that's when I do certain books but I put all of the little scraps in here no matter what they were so i can just grab this out in the morning this out in the morning 
and then my journal with me book. And then I have my laces here, all my different things, all the things that I've been stashing, all that stuff I've been, and I haven't been doing this stuff because I've been stashing it. So I got into the stash, guys. I'm not gonna do that again. And so then what I did is all the pockets, tags, and tucks, I went ahead and put them here. So now mine are inside right there. And I'm actually gonna take you along in a video and install some of those into here, okay? But we're only gonna install five into this signature, okay? And that's just the one signature. The sermon notes journal, that's totally different. My altered book, which you've seen this video, I believe. And I put all of everything to make that book in here. So I can just pull this out. This made it easy. I would like to install this envelope in here. That's one of those. Isn't that cool? It's all raised. So I will be installing that into here. Okay, so that is how I'm keeping the journals organized. And then right now, the journal I'm working on, 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 is this one, right? But I'm working on this journal, but I have a rack that has about 30 journals on it that are already created, and I'm just buttoning them up. So that gives you an idea of where I'm at. So guys, I did a great job, right? So journal I'm working on, I'm making my list. I am going to be sharing how I actually end up building this business. You know, I did hair for so long. So building this business is gonna be great fun. And um, I wanted just to share this with you today. And we got it all down, guys. Look at this, down into two bins, cleaning up all of our scraps scrap happy we're gonna get those done and what else do we got to do give you a better view of where we are what else do we need to do that's it i have some new projects that are coming up that i'm super duper 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 excited about and um yeah some new projects under the desk some things that I haven't seen anyone do. I'm actually gonna look up the videos today and see if anyone's done them. And then I came up with that new pocket this morning in prayer. And I haven't seen that pocket, so I'm gonna go search to see if someone's done it because I'm super curious. And I'm sure someone has, but... So, good seeing you guys. See you in the next one. Thanks for joining. Please like, share, and subscribe. And check out all of my social media. And make sure you hit that notification button for when I put videos up. I appreciate you. Have a blessed day. Take care. Bye.